why did you decide that, that Hearts was where you wanted to, to play your football on a permanent basis? Uh, I signed Hearts because uh, Hearts is a very big team in Scotland and well-known team as well and uh, uh, the management, everyone involved in the team, they are very good people and uh, I'm happy here so that's why I signed for them. And clearly you, you enjoyed your time here last season when you were on loan and it's a club you can develop as a player you think? Yes, of course, such a team like this, I think uh, is the best place for me to be at the moment and I think uh, I can improve upon my game, every game that I played last season. Were there other clubs who were interested in you? Did you knock back any other interest from any other sides? Yes, of course, there are two clubs in the Premiership, English Premiership, were interested in me, but I should stay in the house. I'm going to ask you who those clubs were. <laughs> um, uh, the idea is uh, Bolton and uh, Newcastle as well. So some people will be very surprised that you turned down the chance to, to go to England because a lot of people see, see that as a, the best league in the world. So, so why did you do that? I know, but uh, I wanted to stay one more year with Hearts fans. You know, I don't go in for the money. I played for, for the Hearts. You know, I love Hearts and I wanted to serve them at least one more year before leaving them to get one of the biggest teams in, U in, in the pre English Premiership. So you, you, you will maybe go to, to England one day, maybe in a year, maybe two years? Uh, it will depend on how the, the game will go, will go. That is my aim, but uh, I wanted to stay with Hearts this year and then uh, uh, serve them well before leaving. Hi, have you spoken to your, your countryman, Michael Essien? Have you talked to him about what the Premiership might be like if you got the chance to do it? Yes, I've been talking to him a lot and I have a, a lot of ideas about the Premiership, English Premiership because I've been watching a lot of games in the Premiership, so I think I have I have an idea of English Premiership. But obviously, you're up here this season. Do you think that this season is the, the season that Hearts can really maintain a challenge for the SPL title? Yeah, this is how I am, you know. I can see this is my first training with the team and uh, I can see from the players' faces that they are ready for the battle, you know, and I think uh, they are going to do everything possible to, to win something this season. There's been so much instability at the club in the last year, two years. Is it important that the coaching staff um, remain as they are? You, is it important that Stephen Frail you know, maybe remains as coach and keeps the, everything stable here? You know, uh, since I've been with the club, I've, I'm very satisfied with the management, the coaches around me. So I think uh, they should maintain the same distance. And if they maintain the same uh, situation, I think we can win something in, in this year. There's obviously there been a lot of talk about players maybe leaving. Craig Gordon's one of the players that um, a lot of people, a lot of clubs down south are looking at. How big a blow would it be if he left the club? I think uh, Greg Gordon is uh, quite an important player in the team. He's our uh, number one goalkeeper. He's a very good boy and I think he's very good for the team. So definitely if Greg Gordon leaves this team, he's going to affect the team. So I'm pleading to him to stay because we need him. Is it quite unsettling, obviously, that the players are back at pre-season now? Is it, is it unsettling to hear stories that the players could be leaving? Um, I, I think, uh, uh, I hope uh, none of the players will leave, you know, because uh, we need all the players around us. We need all the good players in this team to form up a very good team this season. So uh, I'm pleading to all the players that they should uh, manage to stay in the team this season. Would you, would you say that, that Hearts can, can be right up there challenging the old firm as they were two seasons ago? I know you weren't here then, but can they get back up and to, to their very best again this, this season coming? Yes, this is our aim. We can do. We can do that because, uh, uh, as I said, you know, I can see uh, my colleagues are happy and then they are working hard and training and stuff. So if we maintain that, I think before the beginning of the season, we can, we can challenge. Uh, the bigger teams in the SPL to win something. Do you think there's a big gap between Hearts and Rangers and Celtic? Oh, I don't think so. I don't think so because we are equal. It's just that they they, ha they are lucky and they, 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 they are winning their games and stuff. We need to uh, forget about them and then concentrate on our games and then win the games. That's all. They seem to have a lot more money to spend, especially Celtic. How much will that maybe have a, a bearing on next season? I mean, they, they can spend over £4 million on the one player. Uh, you know, it doesn't matter who the team, who the, which team spends more than the other. That mm. depends on the players. You understand? You can buy uh, ten Ronaldinos if they don't, they doesn't perform. <laughs> you you will not get the result. So it doesn't matter if the team is spending a lot of players on the players, mm. uh, and the other is not spending a lot. But 
it will depend on the player, how seriousness and uh, 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 everything that the players will do on the field, that's all. Realistically, how long do you think you'll, you'll be at, at Hearts? I've signed the three years deal, so I'm concentrating on my contract. You mentioned Ronaldinho, Hearts are coming, or Barcelona are coming over here to play Hearts very soon. How much are you looking forward to that? Yeah, I'm very happy about that because uh, uh, Barcelona is a very big team, so it's a very big challenge for us, all our players, to play against such a team uh, to show that you two you are at that level. I've already played one or two players in uh, Barcelona's team, in the national team level, so I think I will be fine. Be fine.